A day after two suspected terrorists were gunned down by police in Mombasa County, witnesses have emerged accusing the police of executing one of the suspects, Salim Mohammed, even after arresting him instead of taking him to court. According to witnesses, the suspect was arrested in a matatu and interrogated for several minutes before being bundled in a silver saloon car that sped off. They arrested him, they handcuffed him, he was really mobilized. The best thing they could have done was to take him to police. Why executing him here? And then you see them giving fake statements in the newspaper that he was the most wanted. And we've recovered this and this and this. Where are those things? In his house, Salim's brother-in-law, Twalha Suleiman, says after the police entered with Salim, they were all ordered to vacate the house only to later find him dead on his bed. <laughs> Meanwhile, Fatuma Mohamed Masuo and Rahma Hassan, wives to Kasim Omondi and Sali Mohamed respectively, appeared before a Mombasa court charged with being in possession of illegal arms. Fatuma was allegedly found in possession of an AK-47 rifle, a Glock pistol and several rounds of ammunition without authority from firearms licensing officers. Rahma, who appeared before a Shanzu court, denied two charges of being in possession of an AK-47 rifle and 145 rounds of ammunition. The cases are set for mentioning on July 2nd and had on July 24th and September 27th, 2013, respectively. Masijuma, NTV.